Hi everyone, my name is Gabby Arenda and I'm a digital reporter with Coin6 News. And I'm here to tell you how you can make your own AC unit at home with just a few simple steps to get you through this heat wave that's hitting the Portland metro area this weekend. Well, let's go ahead and get started. First, you need a styrofoam cooler like this one. You wanna go with the larger size if you have an option. Next, you need a small fan. I went with a four inch USB connected desktop fan. Place the fan on top of your styrofoam cooler because it's time to start measuring. Draw an outline of the fan with a marker. I used a Sharpie permanent marker for a defined line. You'll then need to also outline one or two PVC elbows. You can find these at any home improvement store. I also went with two elbows for my cooler, but you can go with one if your fan is smaller and want a lower temperature. Once all items are outlined, use a small kitchen knife to cut out the holes. Make sure to be careful when doing this step. Also, make sure to cut inside the line so your fan can rest on the cooler. You can always cut more if needed. If things get messy after cutting, feel free to vacuum. Your housemates will appreciate it. Now, time to get cool. Grab one or two bags of ice and place them inside of the cooler. I went with one bag and then placed ice water bottles and ice packets inside. However, two bags can fit. Then, put the lid with your cutouts on top of the cooler and place your fan and PVC elbows in their designated spots. I added fun little streamers to my elbows, just to know that there's wind coming out. Now plug in or connect your fan and turn it on to feel some cool air. I grabbed a cooking thermometer to measure the room's temperature at start. It was sitting at 75 degrees. I then put the probe inside one of the elbows to measure the temperature. After a couple of minutes, the thermometer settled at 64 degrees. And there you have it, your own AC unit. 